Hello, welcome to Jade Kind Video Gaming. My name is Adam, here as Violet in Pokemon Violet. And we, we, we got to this, this lovely region for the, the DLC, and we've looked around town, but after spending the night here, it sounds like we might have an option for something to do with um, the second part of the DLC, which I might be interested in doing first. So, that would be over here. So, let me just fly here to the Uva Academy. And while I'm back here, there is another thing that I, I learned of that I was like, might as well check out. So, we're going to hop into our menu. And the portal. Mystery gift. Code. And where was that? We have. Is it spelled right? Let me see. The first word is just correct. Sweet. And then. We have sweet or spicy. Searching for gifts. What did I get? Come on, be sweet. Ah! Okay. So, I discovered there was a mystery gift code that could possibly give you sweet or possibly give you spicy or mystica. And we, of course, have... Um... Yeah, yes, just gonna... We, of course, have the, the teacher that wants sweet or mystica. I was like, hey, maybe we can actually get that for him. Well, apparently, no. <laughs> but I tried. Alright. Oh, well. Let's let's go talk to Director Club. Oh. Hmm. Who do we have here? I know I've seen your face somewhere before. Who are you again? I'm Violet. Oh, that's right. You're Violet. Yes, yes. I know you. Well then, uh, now that you're here, let's get going. Wait, just a moment, Director Carano. Oh, hello there, Bailey. Uh, you're as lively as always. I didn't realize you were here. Of course I'm here. As director of this academy, where else would I be? And do address me more properly while students are present, would you? More importantly, uh, what are you doing out here? I thought we had agreed to meet in my office. Did we? I must have slipped my mind. Anyway, uh, what's the matter? Uh, this the student, right? Well, yes, she is, but... Ah, I do apologize, Miss Violet. You must be terribly confused. This is Director Carano of Blueberry Academy. As I mentioned on the phone, he's interested in accepting you as an exchange student. Yep, that's me, Director Carano, er... Did I not mention that? One look at our young friend here makes me suspect you indeed failed to clarify that point. Speaking of which, why did you request Miss Violet specifically to take part in your exchange program? Excellent question. Question, really? It's very simple. You see, the reason is... Uh, hmm. Why did I put in that request? Oh, that's right. My sources told me there was a student here worth keeping an eye on. 
I asked around a bit, and you do seem to have left an impression on quite a lot of people. Now that I've gotten to meet you for myself, yeah? I've got a good feeling about you. Oh, I'm glad to hear that, Dr. Carano. I'd just love for you to visit my school. You would be a breath of fresh air, so to speak. Well, if anything can be said about Director Carano, it's that he has a keen eye for talent. I would be thrilled if you went to Blueberry Academy and got to know the students there, but only if you're willing to, of course. Think of it as a chance to further expand upon your treasure hunt. I wish I could accompany Miss Violet, but I'm afraid I must ask you to watch over her in my stead. You will watch over her, won't you? Oh, of course. I'd never let anything happen to one of your students. I hope this experience leads you to even more you can treasure. Best of luck to you. Just give me a holler whenever you're ready to head to my Blueberry Academy. Are you all ready to kick off your studies abroad at Blueberry Academy? Yep. Great, then let's get going. I even got the blueberry shorts for it. The hidden treasure of Area Zero. Part 2, the Indigo Disc. I'll get back to part one eventually, don't worry. <laughs> ah, I've seen this. What on earth are we at? Ta-da, we're here. Welcome to my grand Blueberry Academy. I've seen this. It's in one of the James Bond movies. This is actually just the entrance. The school itself is mostly underwater. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. Yeah, from, from James Bond, right? I thought he blew this place up. <laughs> oh, and did you notice? Look at how blue the place is. I can't tell you how long I spent picking the perfect blueberry color. Let's see, what else? Uh, perhaps you have something you'd like to ask me. Why did you pick Blueberry for the name? Really? That's what you're curious about? Well, it's very simple, you see. It's, uh... It's because in the language of flowers, the blueberry is said to represent a fruitful life. I think that's where it came from, right? Yes, right, exactly. Took the words right out of my mouth. Always on point, aren't you, Lacey? Oh no, it was nothing. Do we have a guest today? We do. Violet is here as part of the exchange program. Make her feel welcome, eh? Hold on. This is the exchange student from the Paldea region? I suppose I didn't introduce myself, did I? I'm Lacey, one of the second year students here. You must really be something special, you know? It's rare for Director Cara Carano to remember the name of a new student. Huh. Just call me out, why don't you? Actually, I've got an idea. Why don't you explain how things work around here, Lacey? You, you, you want me to do it? Well, yeah. You know this tour guide stuff isn't my strong suit. Well, that's certainly true, but still, I imagine there must be someone more suitable than me. Oh, but please don't take it like... It's not that I don't want to show you around or anything. Director Carano just has this bad habit of pushing his duties onto me, you see? And it's just not right. Really, letting me have it today, aren't you? That said, this might be my chance to get to know the new students everyone's talking about before anyone else can. That decides it. I will take on this task. Excellent. Now then, let's head straight down this bridge and to the entrance. On you go.
You can get a gorgeous view of the sunset from this walkway, you know? So, again, like before... First things first, let's turn and walk the other way. Where's my next class again? I forget which biome my next class is in. Biome? The polar biome shower is cold. We gotta huddle up if we're headed to the polar biome. Brr. Yes. Well, there's a magma. Welcome. Hey, welcome to Blueberry Academy. It's pretty wild the first time you come to school by riding a subway to an undersea elevator, huh? Now, before we really go further, we also want to check the map. Okay. Okay. This is crazy. Crazy map. Kinda cool. Where? Uh, I didn't see it either. Need more Pokeballs. Man, no matter how many Pokeballs I have, it's never enough. You should. Go do some barbecues. Once you've earned the BP, you can buy some nice Pokeballs. BP barbecue points. So instead of sandwiches here, they like barbecue. At our school, we talk to Pokemon. At our school, you won't cut it, it if you can't hold your own in a Pokemon battle. The exchange student? So you're the exchange student people keep talking about. You don't look that strong. Come on, battle me. This is the entrance to Blueberry Academy. Our school puts a great deal of emphasis on the art of Pokemon battling. We hold official matches on this central court right here at the entrance, and any student can freely utilize this court if it's not otherwise in use. I think it's safe to say that you'll be battling more here than in any other school. Exactly. Couldn't have said it better myself. Director Carreno, I think perhaps it's fine if you just leave the tour to me. Still, it's really relaxing here with the sea breeze blowing over you. Even when no one is battling, you often see students lazing ab about in the stands. Oh, oh, oh. And there's one other quality of our school that you'll likely find very surprising. Wild Pokemon sometimes terrestrialize here. Yeah? Oh, I suppose that's not anything special to someone from Baldea, is it? The terrestrial phenomenon was first discovered in the Paldea region, after all. But we've taken things a step further than you and your Terra Orbs. We've developed some neat tech ourselves, something that lets us control the terrestrial phenomenon in our own turf. I bet that piques your interest, doesn't it? Sure. Um, sir, I, I think it would be will be easier to understand how all that works after we go to the lower level. If you could put a little pin on that thought. Always thinking ahead. That's our Lacey. Oh, you know what? I think it'd be great if the two of you had a battle. Well, right now? Why not? I'd like to see what Violet here is capable of. And our Lacey is a member of the Elite Four in the league club we have going here. To say nothing of the influence of her father, one of the, the Unova region's famed gym leaders. I bet you'll learn a thing or two. Oh, I wish you wouldn't go spreading personal information without asking first. It's just not right. Give me a good show, you two. I'm sorry, but there's no negotiating with Dr. Carano. And once he gets an idea in his head, there's no way that he'll move in on with the tour until we've given him his battle. Besides, 
I have to admit, I'm a little excited myself at the chance to battle you. Here at Blueberry Academy, we tend to go for double battles. Let's give one a try to get to know each other a little better. Okay. Where are you in the levels here? Because this should be higher level than things were before. Challenged by Pokemon Trainer Lacey. Lacey and mine on. Got my evolutions. And I suppose I'm representing Blueberry Academy in this battle. I'll try not to disappoint. Yep, I am under level with these Pokemon. Twice as many Pokemon as she does, so... Whew! Umbreon's not doing so hot. Oh, that's a lot of restoration. And you took out both. Okay. So, of course, my high level is water. Um, So we're faster now. Oh no. Yeah, I know it is. Oh, and now your apparel is great. I might just accept defeat on this.
All right, quick claw. Oh no, not enough. Like if we can take one out. I didn't prioritize. But also, you can just see the difference in, like, going to, like, the other region and everyone being so much lower level than me. Here, they're higher. Okay, 80 bucks. I'm relieved I can pull out a win. It was a positively white-hot battle, after all. The students here at Blueberry Academy were only recently issued Terra Orbs, so I hope you'll be able to teach us more about them. Well done to the both of you. You really battled it out Blueberry style. Speaking of style, I forgot to add... I forgot I had a uniform for you. Uh, you'll feel like you fit in as soon as you're dressing the pot. It suits you beautifully. Now that's what I call fashion. Oh, and you can take this as well. Indigo style card. Uh, having one of these cards increases the selection available uh, to you in boutiques and hair salons. Hmm. That should give you a few more options when you visit shops and salons uh, and such in Paldea. Now that you look the part and hopefully feel it too, why don't we head into the school? You can pick up where you want to go from the gates over there. Come on, I can show you the pride of Blueberry Academy, a world-famous famous terrarium. Okay, so first let's... Okay, so tracksuit... Winter uniform, we just saw the autumn, summer, spring. Summer it is. Oh, and I even changed my bag. I think I'm okay with that. I saw it. I saw your battle with Lacey. I'd never seen some of those Pokemon before. I just can't get my head around these the material in rock type studies too. Try the savannah. Um, why not try catching a ride ho horn in the savannah biome? Double battles. Here at Blueberry Academy, it's double battles or nothing. I guess that's probably because they're open they open up your strategic options. And also we want to just make it feel different. No one with anything else to say. Welcome to Blueberry Academy. You can get to the school facilities using the gates on either side of this desk. Where do you want to go? I guess Terrarium. Undersea Nature Park, where you can learn about Pokemon as you explore its four biomes. Where am I on the map? Okay, so I'm on, like, the side over by Savannah. So it doesn't, like, take me into the middle. It takes me over to the side. Wild. Cutscene.
wild. This is it, the park beneath the sea that has gained renown around the world. Our very own terrarium. We may be underwater, but the projectors built into the walls and ceiling make it feel like we're actually outside, don't they? We've been able to create a comfortable environment for Pokemon through technology. I designed it all, all this myself, and believe me, it wasn't cheap. Within this dome, there are four distinct biomes. Here we have the nice and toasty subtropical savanna biome. Then off to your right, you can see the breezy tropical coast biome. Further out to your left, you'll see the craggy, crunchy, rugged canyon biome. But last but not least, way out in the distance, we have the arctic and snowy polar biome. Each biome's air temperature and humidity levels are regulated with the utmost care. That's why you can find completely different Pokemon species living in each area. We should put a lot of effort into it. Tell me, Violet, which biome tickles your fancy off the bat? I... Part of me is all, like, coastal, because I want a water Pokemon, but I... I'm guessing Savannah? Because it's a... Crocodile Pokemon? It's a very familiar sort of environment, isn't it? The open stretches of land make it very easy to observe how the Pokemon are living. If you need to heal up your team while you're down here, feel free to use the self-serve healing machines we've installed around the terrarium. Now then, Director Carano, can you explain uh, to us with crystals from here and how the wild Pokemon are able to terrestrialize? I, hmm, uh, but don't you already, you know already, Lacey? That, oh, I get it. You want me to do the talking. In that case, let me show you. The reason is actually right above our heads. That there is the terrarium core, which presides over all that happens in the terrarium. It contains a fluid that we've jam-packed full of a special material from Baldea. A constantly emitting terrestrial energy, that's what allows Pokemon to terrestrialize in the dome. Wonderful. Well said, sir. That's exactly right. Though... I still don't know what that special material is within the terrarium core itself. It's never been shared publicly, has it? Ho ho ho! You want to know? Well, it, in fact, it's... it's... Uh, what was it? Was it? I've them forgotten. But I put it all, all of it together, so I'm not certain myself. That's what I thought you might say. Bing bong bong bing! Practical battle class will commence shortly in the coastal biome. Students participating in this class should make their way to the coastal biome now. Bong, bing, bing, bong. Oh, it looks like you're just in time to see a class session, too. This is too good of a chance to pass up. Won't you join us, Violet? You can get your first taste of our school's classes. Sure. Tee-hee. <coughs> I do love to see that sort of passion for education. I'll go ahead and register the terrarium map to your Rotom phone for you. I think I already had it. Terrarium map on your map app. It's fun to take a stroll through the terrarium on your own, and I think I'd be more of a hassle than anything if you had me holding your hand. So yep, that settles it. Please find your way to the class site in the coastal biome on your own. Well, it doesn't seem like I'm needed here. Wait, sir, you don't... But I've made sure that a dorm room has been all set up for you, Violet, so don't forget to give it a visit later. Oh, yes, and one other thing. Could you open your Pokedex app for me? Blueberry Pokedex has been added to your Pokedex app. Catch as many Pokemon here in the terrarium as you please. Don't be afraid to go saws buck wild your student life here at Blueberry Academy, so remember to live it up to the fullest. And there he goes. Well, you can at least count on me to be around when you need me, so there's no call for concern. It's probably time we both head to class. I'll be waiting for you to join us in the coastal biome. Okay. 
Wild. Um, well, with that... Let's... Pokedex. And of course, we looked at the Kitakami Pokedex before, but what's the Blueberry Pokedex? Oh, I need 90 to get anything. And just taking a look at what Pokemon that I already have seen or have that are in here. <laughs> Guess I just saw those ones. Oh no. Whoops, went to the beginning by mistake. Here we go, back to where we were. Oh, that was the end of it. That's why. Well. Next time, I suppose, we'll start exploring here. We've made it. <laughs> we're at Blueberry Academy. Obviously, we're a little under-leveled, but we'll see what we can accomplish. <laughs>